come, we are on our journey during this Lenten time. Our symbol for the second week of is a shell. A shell that looks like this one and in Christianity represents baptism. We remember when Jesus was baptized by John the Baptist in the Jordan River. Perhaps his shell was found and water was poured out on Jesus' head. We remember Jesus walking along the shore and calling his first disciples. A shell like this one might have been used to hold out to the crowd to beg. The scripture for this second Sunday is from Mark chapter 10, verses 35 through 45. In your passport book, if you would notice, our travel date is February the 28th. Our scripture is Mark 10, 35 through 46. Two of the disciples, according to the scripture, James and John, were walking with Jesus, as so the other ten, and they asked Jesus for a special request. They asked to be the ones to sit on his right hand and on his left hand when he came into his glory. Jesus said, you don't know what you're asking. Can you be baptized with the baptism I am baptized with? And they said, yes, we can. Jesus said, you will drink the cup I drink and be baptized with the baptism I am baptized with, but to sit on my right hand and my left hand is not for me to grant. Those places belong to those for whom they have been prepared. Now, when the other 10 disciples heard this, they were very upset. Jesus called them together and he said, you know that those who are regarded as rulers of the Gentiles lorded over them and their high officials exercise authority over them. Not so with you. Instead, whoever wants to become great among you must become your servant. And whoever wants to be first must be a slave of all. For even the Son of Man did not come to be served, but to serve, and to give his life as a ransom for many. So the first to be last, and the last to be first. Let us pray. Merciful Lord, as we journey with you, help each of us to be wise in what we are asking. May we seek always to serve you. Amen.